Looney Tiles During the summer seasons, the temperature inside our home becomes very high. To manage our lifestyle, we are moving towards the air conditioners to resolve it. But we are still facing some more troubles inside our rooms due to heat penetration from the terrace. To overcome that, here comes the solution in the form of Looney Tiles. You can eliminate the terrace heat by laying Looney Tiles. Considering the increase of global warming and environmental safety as prime factor, we created Looney Tiles. Even at very high temperature, children and old age people can walk with barefoot on the Looney Tile surface without feeling the heat. You can measure the heat difference between Looney Tile surface and other clay tile surface by using laser infrared thermometer on the surface of the tiles. You can fix Looney Tiles on your terrace by following three simple stages which makes your terrace more brighter and better. Stage 1 Before fixing the Looney Tiles on your terrace, first clean the surface completely and arrest porous areas and hairline cracks that appeared on the terrace. Then mark sloping points for free flowing of water. After that, spread grano flooring concrete based on sloping points. For preparing grano flooring, use the proper ratio of 1 is to 1.5 is to 3, which means 1 part of cement, 1.5 parts of sand and 3 parts of 12 mm or 20 mm blue metal chips. Stage 2 Prepare base work on grano flooring concrete surface for fixing loony tiles. The base work must be in the ratio of 1 is to 5 which means 1 part of cement and 5 parts of sand. Spread a mix of cement with water on the surface before it gets dry. You can also add waterproofing compounds based on the needs in the above mentioned mixture for additional waterproofing. For proper retention of tiles over the cement, make some scratches accordingly on the surface. Fix loony tiles on the surface where the scratches made by leaving 8 mm space between each tile. Use 8 mm spaces between tiles for obtaining consistent and neat spaces. While fixing loony tiles, it is better to follow the method of an alternate joint fixing pattern. Avoid walking on the surface of tiles immediately after fixing. To avoid walking, it is wise to begin fixing tiles from opposite sides of the entrance. Stage 3 For skirting tiles, cut our loony tiles into two pieces using a cutting machine by marking it in center. To avoid leakage of water in the side corners, groove the plastering area on bottom of the parapet walls. Make soft compound of cement mix of ratio 1 is to 3 using one part of cement and three parts of sand along with adequate water and waterproofing compound. Paste the compound on the parapet wall along 45 degree angle. To fill the gap between the tiles, prepare soft mortar mix with one part of white cement along with two parts of fine sand. Also add waterproofing compounds while preparing. Instead of fine sand, you can also use white sand or marble powder as an alternative while preparing soft mortar mix. Fill the soft mortar mix consistently over the gaps between the tiles laid. After an hour, once the surface gets dry, clean the surface using a wet cloth to remove excess soft mortar mix. Again, clean the entire terrace area using a wet cloth for obtaining neat clean terrace. Pour water two times a day during morning and evening for about two days in the terrace. After that, it is advisable to store water for two days on the terrace. To avoid the formation of cracks and to obtain a neat surface, then you can avoid heat convection and water seepages on your terrace by following the above three simple steps. And handling instructions It is important to stack loony tiles in a proper way. There is a chance for tiles to get damaged while stacking in a horizontal manner.
so better avoid stacking more tiles in a horizontal manner.